Do you know the Episcopal motto of your bishop? Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki, and last month I participated in the installation of a new bishop. In the program, they had a picture of his coat of arms, half of which has the coat of arms of the diocese, and the other half of which has his personal coat of arms. Then, underneath the shield is the motto that the bishop chose. Today's saint, Pius X, who was pope from 1903 to 1914, chose as his motto a line from St. Paul's letter to the Ephesians, to renew all things in Christ. He explained his reason for choosing that motto in an encyclical he wrote shortly after becoming pope. He asked, who can fail to see that society is at present more than in any past age suffering from a terrible and deep-rooted malady which, developing every day and eating into its inmost being, is dragging it to its destruction. And what was the illness that Pope Pius saw? The rejection of God. This was the evil that he saw behind the conflicts that would eventually lead to World War I. Pope Benedict said a similar thing, that a world without God is a world without hope. Now, do you know the motto that Pope Benedict chose when he became bishop? It's in a line from John's third letter, verse 8, where it's translated, co-workers in the truth. It shouldn't surprise you that Pope Benedict's first encyclical is called Charity in Truth. God is love and truth, and his servants, Pope Pius X a hundred years ago, and Pope Benedict were co-workers in the truth, without which there will be no peace.